Okay, so uh, physical, my fitness-wise, I'm I guess I'm medium. I don't work out every day, but I do I do uh, go for a run on the weekends or like like every other day or every every other other day. Like I, I run at least two times a week, about a mile, which is I do in about ten minutes, which is not good, but I can improve. And uh, when running gets boring for me, I uh, just do the jump rope, which is a good alternative. And uh, yeah, either that or boxing right there, which is basically. Another thing, if you get bored, like, I'm not a pro, but it, it kind of helps in working out. And nutrition is uh, right here. Before, I just used to eat burgers and whatnot, but um, now I got my protein, I got my water, I got my calcium, and uh, more protein, water, calcium. Like, I'm not a big eater anymore. I've, I eat a lot less than I used to, so I consider that a, a big achievement on my part. But, uh, but, yeah, otherwise, for physical, it's... I'm proud to say I'm pretty decent at that. Okay, so the next part is a psychological, which is coping skills and stress management. And I think they go hand in hand because when you're stressed out, you cope with it. And when you're coping with it, you're basically managing your stress when you're coping with it. And uh, people do it their own way. And I, I basically do it, I, I would imagine, like other people, like, you know, like, play video games, go on the computer, uh, listen to music, go for a walk or something, and uh, I guess one thing, I, I like to drive also, like, I like to just go for like long drives when I'm stressed out or even for fun, so I guess driving is also another thing that I, I, I vent my stress with, and um, so basically there's nothing much else to say other than like, if you're stressed out, then First you calm down, you think it over, and then you go straight to the problem, and you uh, and you just deal with it. That's what I do. All right, that was it for my psychological. Okay, so the next one is a uh, social, which is positive interactions and behavior. And uh, I rate myself on a scale of one or one to ten. I'm probably like a six or a seven. I'm not that. I'm not that big of a socialite, and uh, I know that's not that's something that I should change because obviously. I'm sure in the professional world you need to talk to people and if you want to be like a manager someday you need to have people skills and whatnot so I consider that very important so the way I would change that is uh, I would go out and talk to people which is where curiosity ties in really nicely because you can talk to people about things you may not know and they can and that way you gather information from them and in the process you you basically you socialize you talk about things you don't know or you tell them things they don't know and you guys, like, you know, you guys mingle and socialize, and you guys learn from each other, which is, I think is a very important aspect of socialization. And the reward is in itself. You're, you learn, you make friends, and even build a good network. So it kind of rewards itself. So, yeah, that's my piece for uh, social. Okay, this part is the uh, environmental part, and it's personal steps to the protection of the environment. And I think it's pretty simple. I, for one, I litter, but... I don't, I don't litter as bad as other people, I litter like once in a while, I'd like if there's like no garbage coming out at all, I just walk by a bush and just, just throw the bottle in there, but uh, yeah, I think when it comes to being outside the house, I tend to litter a lot more than I do inside the house, the inside of my house is pretty clean, so I'm just hoping I can change my way of thinking towards the outdoors as well, because outdoors, I mean, I think that my mentality is that, oh, they hire people to clean up afterwards, so it's okay to litter, but it's not, and I have to change that as well. So what, how, 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 how I'll go about changing that is uh, just cleaning up after myself at least, you know, like, if not others, then at least myself is all contributing as well. So I believe I should, it's simple to just change my way, like just walk over, throw the garbage away, and just throw the plastics in, in the right container, you know, garbage goes in the brown one, and uh, plastics and bottles in that one simple as that, and, uh, and yeah, I mean, and, and if you, those are also my future steps in a way, and I guess the rewards is cleaner environment, and uh, also if, if, if I recycle outside of, uh, you also get money for recycling and things, so that's another good uh, reward, you get money for recycling bottles, so yeah, in the end it pays, so that's my piece on environmental.